going Sheik this time. Uh, probably trying to see how it works out for him. Because I believe he did not play Sheik versus, uh, uh, versus Nitro. He went straight to Wolf. I mean, I feel like his Wolf has definitely had more success in the matchup, but like Sheik definitely doesn't do bad. Well, when, you're up, when you're up a full set, basically, like you have games to to give in order to like test, test out the waters, basically. Quite right. Quite right. Alright. again gets the quick nair. And again, like, Sheik is just racking up all these fares in the Bouncing Fish, and, you know, Nitro is just struggling to put up his wall. <laughs> Nitro walking away. <laughs> Did not want to do that oh, no, his for a second. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> okay. Okie dokie. All right, so uh, Sheik, good zone breaker, evidently. Um, I feel like, compared to like how the previous set started between these two, he's having a much easier time dealing with getting into the yeah, just getting into the situation. All right. She is smaller, objectively speaking. She can crouch under certain attacks. All right. Uh, and she's faster too. So exactly. You know, she she he, she loses the kill power, but she gets so much more out of it. Uh, she she gets an actual like winning neutral versus the Belmonts. Yeah, I mean, like, he threw Axe, and she was immediately in his face, whereas Wolf kind of had to, like, Be like, hopefully get a dash attack, right? right? So. All right, but uh, first stock, even percent. Despite, like, the way the game started, it still seems to be moving similarly to how it's gone in the past, except this time, K9 gets the first stock. I mean, this is just one of those run. characters where, like, you could win neutral, like, 70% of the time, but like Nitro, when he wins neutral, he does like easily like twice the amount of damage that K9 does when he wins neutral. Well, it's, it's all dependent on how much time K9 has winning that. All right, so okay, he's he's getting this entire like stage, put putting traps everywhere, <laughs> whether it's the cross or down tilting underneath the cross. But now he's getting fared all over the place. Oh, missed the Nair. Gets hit with Nair four times, only eats like 12%. Sad days. I mean, she can have bad, bad damage. That's not what she's about. She's about, oh. She's about dying at like <laughs> sub, sub 70. That's what she's about. That's my line, I was going to say that. <laughs> uh, unfortunate. Unfortunately, K9 was acting very aggressive. And then the second. Nitro got off stage first. He was like, "All right, well, I'll put the little let me little let me press water. my funny button." Bam. Bam. That was a great trap, though. Yeah. Acknowledging that, you know, not letting K9 walk all over him for free. And again, and now it's up to K9 to like make up the deficit. Yeah. Good call, on Nitro. You know, sometimes taking a step away is the better call. Ooh, I like what K9 was trying to do, trying to punish the landing, but. You know what? Nitro kind of like one step ahead at this point, but... <laughs> okay, good call. Great call. Yep. Great awareness. Okie dokie. Oh, crouching. Getting poked by Dagger. Ooh, man. Oh, but unfortunately the, the Holy Wars is going to uh, prevent him from following up on his uh, zone breaking. Uh-oh. The dare. Yeah. Okay, it doesn't matter. Yep. I got you off stage, and oh my god, if he had managed to land that bouncing fish, you know that would have put Nitro in such a horrible position. That was a weird movement thing. What? What? <laughs> I'll have to rewatch that later. Oh, oh, the up oh my god, up up tilt nearly killed. Like that's a move you don't see killing until like 180, 200 percent. Uh oh. All right, we're gonna probably see some whips. Yep. Oh, he went for the up special. Kanon has to be really close when he's right. up in his face. I mean, yeah, like pretty much like any any aerial will probably kill him at this point. Dash attack though? I mean, I guess. Yeah, yeah sure. Oh, boy. And again, K9 is just... Oh, no, but the 
Baited the grab with the down tilt one. Yep. That was really smart from Nitro. And again, you could tell that like that was just the last pixel that move would have connected that to. Like that move wasn't even touching Sheik practically. Let's see, is he gonna try it again? I don't think Sheik was a bad pick. I just feel that, you know Wolf can kill. Yeah, it's 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 a situation where you get tiny rewards every now and then for, for picking Sheik over against this character, but like the moment you get swatted like a fly, it's like it just feels awful. So I, I, I understand the character swap. He gave it a shot. Yeah. So, you know, it, it, it tried, and it, it kind of worked, but in the long run, probably going to lose. Okay. Whoa. Right, landing on shield. It didn't quite matter. Oh, that would have been funny if it was a footstool, but... Oh, the dash attack not going to be able to connect. Gets swatted in the air for that. Just going to barely snap on the ledge before the axe comes down. We're living. Okay, great parry. Per sorry, perfect shield. We're not playing third strike. Oh. Have tilt. I don't think I've heard anybody that. call it, like, uh, perfect shield in this game. It's always parry. But back here. And again, you know, K9 looking for the ledge option. Manages to scope out the up smash and gets another one, but not gonna be enough of the up air will be enough to kill out that stock. I definitely I mean I guess he had the read, he knew where to go. Nitro probably was kinda like not happy about nearly dying and then getting hit again and then he just didn't expect to get hit again. Oh, oh no, that's gonna be bad. All right, I mean, right. still has a double jump pose. Oh, good, good weight. Yeah. Really good weight. The great SDI too. Oh, he's dead. Uh, <laughs> yep. There he goes. Oh, oh. Give him a grab. Oh, no tag. We'll take that. And again, no. Oh, no. oh, I like what he was trying to do. He's trying to reflect it back, but oh god, no! The wolf, <laughs> no. the wolf fire is gonna get hit by that the, the holy water. I feel like uh, it would have been really good to do fair instead of F tilt there. He probably tried it, but landed at that point. All right. Oh, oh, oh he, he waited that yeah, time, but not quite long enough to beat out the get up option. He learned after like the three times it happened. I mean, I'm pretty sure it. that up smash can hit the entire platform practically if you, if he speaks properly. I don't know. I don't Because it like it like so. it like scoops it up from the side and then like co converges in the middle. He's not Ridley. Alright. <laughs> like, that's a big move, but it's not gonna do that. Still, but great weight. And now he's down a stop. And I didn't re I don't even realize how he lost it. Oh. K9 up. He's keeping the pressure. Oh, I missed the dash grab. Oh. Yeah, again, he spaced it perfectly for the the holy water to oh. hit him off a of ledge too. Yeah, it was really good on him to just empty empty land into shield. And he just does it. Oh my goodness. He was like, okay, I'm, I'm gonna I'm gonna read you coming in. Okay, I was like, that's not gonna hit me. Oh shoot, that hit me. Oh. What? What? Oh, I guess he, he, like, he reflects invincible. Like, 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 like too. Yeah. Or maybe like he or reflected something. it and it hit the, the cross instead. Maybe. Oh, reads the spot dodge, gets the forward smash or gets him with the laser, not gonna be kind enough, gets the down tilt, and he can't make it back. Welcome to the game. Yeah. <laughs> Unfortunate. Like, Alright, but dude, we got dude, Wolf Wolf hit him with the long live the king. We got the one one. Yep. Are we gonna see a stage switch? I don't think he's going to try Battlefield again, which he did try uh, in Winner's Side. If I had to guess, like, maybe try Town, but I feel like that's a stage K9 would ban. Right. I mean, Kalos is, yeah, Kalos is a good stage. Kalos is, uh, Kalos is okay. 
Did he just pick the wild Pokemon theme from, from Sun and Moon? The, the wild Pokemon theme? Really? You're questioning a man's music taste? Really? That one? Okay. You say so. <laughs> it's okay. <laughs> Not my favorite, but it's okay. All right, but he's, he's definitely making a, lot making more a statement headway, yeah. at the very beginning of this match. He's very mobile. He wants he wants to get to this next set as soon as possible. He's just like, okay, I, I let you have the lead. I let you have one game. Now I'm going to do everything I can to take the set before you get too much of a uh, momentum swing. That was great spacing to in the grab ledge after dash ult, too. Oh, there it is. Oh. Nah, he's still living. Oh. Nah, it won't kill, but it, again, it's sending a message to K9 that he can't just walk all over him right now. He won't let him. Okay, oh. Axe. I mean, Axe is going through the stage. I mean, not much K9 can do in that position. With 61% to his name, if he continues his momentum, like it's going to be really hard for K9 to get anything. Especially if he won't let him like do anything to him off stage. He's doing a great job getting that center stage one immediately. I mean, it's kind of hard to edge guard him when you can just hang off a ledge like that. And when you're a wolf with a very, very susceptible recovery, you know you don't want to commit too hard. Old video game, the weird, weird interaction. Oh, oh. <laughs> Oh, he tried up smashing the spot <laughs> dodge, but unfortunately waited a little bit too long for that. Oh. Ooh. Wow, down down aired that up smash call out. Did not care. Alright. Let's see. Oh okay, he's off stage. K9, I think, too close to ledge for that down tilt to hit. I mean, you just see K9 struggling to find the kill at this point. You know? uh, Even then, like, not enough to finish him off. I want to say that up throw was like an air dodge bait, but he didn't punish it at all, which is just unfortunate. Oh, oh gets the dash attack, and I think he's. Oh no, he had the. And he was able to tether back from that range. Dang. Oh, that, is <laughs> that was really smart, because even if, like, that whiffed, the. The, the holy, holy water yeah. would have prevented him from like getting maybe too hard of a punish. Right. At least he would have maybe not like had any a, maybe lag. like a fair or something. Yeah, I mean like it would hit K9 too. So that was a pretty smart play. Oh, the dash grab not gonna catch him. All right, dash attack. Roll in. K9 has to catch these rollers. I feel like generally, generally when he's a uh, when I throw neutral getups, he does two things: he either rolls or he down tilts. Yeah. I mean, like Belmonts don't really have a lot of good escape options on them. Yeah, I'm, I'm just saying, like maybe that's something K9 should keep in mind you know, moving forward in the set. Oh, but man, just has knife out that. That double jump, and yet again, you know, K9, you, you know, he's down in percent, but like when you're up against a Belmont, you know, like if he can get one more gimp like that, he might be able to steal the set away from Nitro. Okay, getting the down, it doesn't matter if you parry that. If you don't have the jump height for it, you're not going to get him. Ooh. Yeah, I mean, a 40% deficit, slowly growing. You know, as long as he's careful to avoid all of Nitro's uh, setups, you know. Oh, fairing that F smash attempt. Oh, I like what he did. He, du he double dumped to bait out the up tilt. Uh oh. And, oh, he was scoping out something, but just wasn't expecting him to actually get it. Oh, that was a great directional air dodge. Recognizing that that was not a safe place to be anymore. <laughs> great reaction. Oh, oh, there's the punish on the dash attack, and yet again, he steals it. Nitro, I was going to say Nitro was getting way too antsy there. Yeah. He was doing jump aerials, he was dash attacking, he was doing too much. Yeah. You know? He wasn't what? playing the, the Richter spacing game. He just wasn't playing 
can't be enough. He wasn't playing optimally. Yeah. It's not about whether you're playing campy or not either. It's about like knowing when when to approach and when to make the other player do it. Because if he's not approaching, Canine's freaking out because how does he any, get in? Yeah, any swipe, he's gonna die for it. All right. You have to use that against your opponent. But it looks like he got town this time. Interesting. And yet again, I wonder if you if Nitro wants these platforms to like kind of like escape too when Wolf is juggling him. It's it's possible. It's definitely possible. But I feel like he's not getting juggled enough for that to be an issue on his mind. Ooh, K9 just barely rolling out of that holy fire range. I mean, like, you can think of it like this. With with the stage transitioning from Final Destination to Reverse Battlefield to, like, I guess, longer callow sleep. <laughs> there's, oh. there's a lot to like about for Richter here. Right. Oh, here, Dodgers off stage. Doesn't get punished for it, though. Gets the back air, and yet again, I like what he did. He used the, the holy water to kind of like say, like, you are not retreating to this platform and trying to punish the, the get up option. Yeah, exactly. Oh. Uh oh. oh. No. I was afraid of another. Ooh, but that I, down tilt to fair will do it. Yeah, that that down air, good move sometimes. That it's a good move when it hits. Situation. Yeah. I mean, even then, like you can get a lot of combos and like cheesy early kills because of it. Ooh, great nair to F to forward aerial. Uh oh, oh, gets a dash attack. <laughs> Axe. Oh, okay. All right. I, I respect it. Oh, falling out of that uppy, unfortunately. Now he is safe on that platform. Oh boy. Yeah. Okay. See, like, like I said in the previous game, I feel like the issue he had near the end was that he wasn't playing his advantage state. He was too aggressive, and you can see now he's running in and running out, trying to make Canine guess when it's safe for him to act aggressively. He's forcing K9 to approach him, forcing him to misspace all of his aerials instead of you know, him misspacing all of his aerials. Exactly. Well, dash, I don't know if I agree with that dash attack, but you know what? He, he got the stock off of it, so he, he's doing something better than I probably would be in that situation. Oh, you wanted the... Oh my god, that he wanted to finish that game right there with a three stock with that down air. <laughs> I think it was... I think it's funnier that it, it doesn't kill. It just sends a message again, you know, like I'm playing with you. Like I have the lead. Like I You need to adapt. Like I'm telling you. If he keeps mixing his aggression and his aggressive and defensive options, he's gonna do a lot better. But he can't just like do it. Oh you saw right there, you know. You know I was trying to he go have for a that. Jump. Oh no! <laughs> K9 I mean, just like, oh, okay, I deserve that. Yeah, uh, he, he, he should have recognized he didn't have a jump mm -hmm. at the end of the day, you know? Like, I guess he didn't want it to come back with uh, an aerial tether, but it was it was great awareness from Nitro recognizing that, oh, okay, he's trying to block it, so I'm just going to hit him. Yeah, and if he touched it, oh well, I have another stock. If he doesn't, I win the game. Exactly. On Yoshi's Island. Oh. Ops, of course, pretty good song. But they ain't picking, so I'm not going to compliment them for it. Ooh, I like that. Just a quick down throw combo. At <laughs> this stage, definitely benefiting down throw. Oh no, he doesn't have a jump! That's a quick zero to death from K9. You know, he's just like, okay, I don't want to go to game 15. We're ending it here at game 10. I don't want to play with you anymore. I want to go home. Yeah. It's late. I want to finish this while it's still Wednesday night fight and not Thursday morning. Oh boy. 
got the reflector. Yeah, this definitely forces Nitro to have to play a lot more patient than he probably would like to because he doesn't want to risk losing another stock so early. And that and then he gets oh he, he wanted that tech read and then going for the the super aggressive up smash again. Moving the option to play aggressively sometimes, making you just have to play super safe is really good because it it means you don't have to worry about the opponent overextending a lot. Oh, but catches the jump with the axe. Oh, but yeah, didn't air dodge that time. Oh. Installing with his jumps, waiting for an option to punish. And again, K9 just trying to find his one aerial to kill. But he gets the dash attack, and is he going to go off stage again? No, he's gonna opt to just be like, okay, I, I I died for it once here, but let me get your your get up option and kill you for that. Yep. Yeah, I mean that. It's unfortunate, but that is like immediate zero to death just really just hurt hurt Nitro a lot this game. Okay, yeah, kind of slowly picking what option he wants to do. Ooh, double jumping. Ooh, and not quite enough percent for that to kill, but, uh, you, you know, sure Nitro. Smash, yeah. I feel. Mm. Uh, he, he is not dead because he was too close. Uh, the stage doesn't, it's, okay, it's okay, Wolf's good. No. <laughs> Okay. Not, not when you air dodge off stage, though. He's not. Okay. He has a little max syndrome, where like if you air dodge off stage, you're dead. Okay, so we've got we've got a pretty relatively even game. I mean, aside from the 68 or 63 percent deficit at this current point in time, that can change really quickly. I mean, yet again, just one clean edge guard, and already like he's evened <laughs> up the percents. The game is now even. Yep. Oh, the game no. is now in Nitro's favor. No! All right, guys. Uh, uh, I hope you're ready for another set of Richter Belmont yep. against K9S Bruce. Because we are going into Thursday morning fights. Uh, this is gonna this is gonna be a slog. Game game 15. Game 15, everybody. Game 15. I didn't ask for this. Oh, nobody asked for this. Nitro didn't even, he doesn't even want to be here at this point. Nitro has left. I think he took a, a second. Uh, my man stabbing himself with his Coca-Cola bottle. Uh, I, said, I said, stabbing yourself with your Coca-Cola bottle. You shattered it, yep. murdered, dead, wants to go home. But now we're time for set two. Returning to Pokemon Stadium, Stadium. two. Uh, not picking a song. I feel like K9 doesn't have a lot to be worried about. He seems pretty calm. Yep. He's got to take what happened that last set and apply it yep. to not letting it happen again. Here we go. Uh, set two of Grand Finals. Quite right. Oh. Boy. <laughs> not a whole lot of, not much happening uh, at the start. They're they're kind of like running around each other, barely missing each other. I mean, at this point, you know, both players are just like, okay, we we've gone to set two. Let let's play super patient because we don't want to lose the momentum starting with this new set. Yeah, I like that. Nitro likes to use uh, holy water when he's halfway through the platform. Because it lets him dip through, but still also set it up. So it prevents a uh, higher option. So it forces K9 to air dodge into situations he probably would not want to be in. Oh, he's dead. Yep. He's dead. Uh, Wolf Flash does not connect to the ledge. So he's going to get a free punish for that. Oh, he charged that a little bit. Actually, maybe K9 went for a down smash instead. Whoops. Uh, K9 landed right in front of him, so that 
Ooh. not matter at all. Really wanted that up smash right there. It was a good mix up though, because he double jumps. That's not really something I've seen Nitro do a whole lot. He usually just short hops and then aerials, or just a full hop aerial attack. So that was a great mix up. He didn't die for it, and he's still alive. And still makes it back on the stage. And now he is grabbed off stage. It, it looks like that um, every time he does cross, he gets like a little boost when he does it while lifting up. That's neat. Canine oh, trying to get punished, but <laughs> no. oh, he wa he wanted the the he wanted the forward smash, but he's just like I'm not gonna have enough time for the forward smash. Let me go for the up smash instead, and it was like wasted his time. <laughs> that was that was neat. It's like he had to be he, he had like three ideas in his head, and he just decided on one of the very last second. Yeah. He was like, I'm gonna do this. No, I'm gonna do this. Oh, I ran out of time. Oops. We he is living. Barely. Oh boy. Oh, he oh, is dead. Yep. He is dead. Oh, Nitro. Nitro on top after that last set. For sure. Okay, opting for the dash attack to get the safer safer damage. Oh, quick up the out of shield to break the combo. Oh. No F smash there, but I do and he like just it. Up B's the dash attack, you know. Recognizing that he's just trying to hit him. He doesn't care. And I, you know, there's so, been so many down air reads that Nitro's been getting that, like, K9 just has not been able to block many of them at all. Okay. Let's see, yeah, dash attack punish. Up, oh, oh uh, nah, he's fine. Yeah. <laughs> I thought he was going to get hit. But it's the, the other direction. And, and the forward tilt will finish that game. We are going to game two. You don't belong in this world. Okay. Do you feel like K9 will opt to character swap? I feel like out of all of his characters. Uh, At this point, his, his wolf has gotten him the most games. I think he's thinking about it. He's thinking about it. Oh, he's going the Mennonite. That makes sense. If you can approach him off stage a lot better with Mennonite than yeah. you can with Sheik and uh, the Wolf. <laughs> I mean, I know S2H loves like gimping people with Mennonite, especially Richters. I know so. S2H also loves Belmont. <laughs> I know he loves this, these characters. Yeah. He's a big fan of the Castlevania series. Oh, yes. But uh, we'll have to see. I feel like this is a great counter pick. We'll have to see what uh, Nitro's matchup knowledge is going to say about this counter pick. I mean, it's one of those matchups where, like, Meta Knight's going to really, really struggle to get in. But, like, if you can get Belmont off stage, you know, that's a free edge guard. I'm only saying because Meta Knight feels like a character maybe kind of K9 has played in a previous game or in the past, but I haven't seen it quite often. I mean, he's... But I'm not saying he's probably bad with Meta Knight or anything. Right. It's, just, it's not a character he is as adept with. I mean, for the most part, like, Meta Knight's mostly unchanged from Smash 4. I mean, the only thing that's, like, really different is his up air, up air, up B combo. And Mock Tornado. Mock Tornado, yeah. Whoop. Yet again, you know, K9 just struggling to find his way in, but manages his own break there, gets the dash attack. Or I wouldn't, I wouldn't say this is bad for for K9. He is at 145 versus 89, but it doesn't matter because what he's looking for right now is those offstage opportunities. That's why he likely. As long this as he doesn't lose his stock, he's still in a position to win. Okay. Yeah. Oh nice. my god, using the stall <laughs> on the, the down air and it gets the up tilt off of it. Not going to be able to quite find anything else, but manages to catch up an up B and gets the forward smash too. Kind of wish can and recognize that and just up beat anyways. Whoa. 
And again, oh, the axe to kind of like cover his ledge guard. That's interesting. It was a short hop. Uh, okay, he didn't have to use the. Uh, oh, he caught. He caught the holy water bottle, but unfortunately, no. Nitro's just gonna snipe him anyways for it. Does not quite matter. Oh, he's dead. There you go. That's the offstage opportunity. Yeah. And you know, as we saw at the last game of uh, set one, it doesn't matter what percent Richter's at if you haggle him enough offstage. He's gone. I mean, you know, all you need is just one hit offstage, and then like he can die at zero basically. He's like Little Mac in that sense. Let's see if we can carry him offstage right now. Oh, oh okay. <laughs> no, we can't. <laughs> Maybe later, though. And no, I was looking for that tech chase read, not going to be able to quite find it. And Nitro just throwing out all these four tails, but gets stuffed out by the Mock Tornado, and he's going to die because he, he directional air dodge. 60% too. Yeah, this is matter. looking really good for K9. Yeah, I'm telling you, this character counter pick, yep. for sure. It means something. Yep, and that's it. And he's dead. Yep, he's dead. He's dead. He's dead. Yeah, all you need is that one offstage edge guard, and you no, know, Richter dies practically at zero. I mean, like at the, at the start of that game, it looked like the counter pick was kind of weird, mm -hmm. but but I don't have to I don't have to say it again. Like you saw what happened. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Kanan has like a smug, like I don't know, it's like a slight smile. I don't know. He looks, he looks a little elated. He is like, ha ha ha. How does it feel to die super early in a cheesy weight belt once? I bet you don't know what it's like to feel like that. No, I don't think it's, it's like ha ha ha. It's like, <laughs> like a, like a slight chuckle. Like a, uh, like, 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 uh, like ha ha. I've, I've succeeded. Chuckle. <laughs> Send that back. <laughs> Run it back, I dare you. Like that kind of chuckle? We're going back to PS2. Now we're fighting Gladion? Oh, th th this is a banger right there. This song's okay. This song's okay? It's better this song it, is okay? The original uh, song is way better. Mm. It's, a, it's a nice remix, but I don't think it's fitting for a, a Smash Brothers title. It's too chill. Especially in a game where they're like, yeah, so we got rid of like the not chill music. We got rid of the chill music because it's not for fighting games. And he, K9's opting to go back wait, to... Wait, 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 I oh. missed that part. What the heck? <laughs> yeah. You didn't notice he went back to Wolf? <laughs> no, I did not. Yeah. Wait a second. <laughs> no, okay. maybe he, he wanted the Mennonite just for the, the stage choice. And once he realized, okay, we're going back to here, let's go back to Wolf, because I can actually abuse platforms a little bit. Did, didn't they play on the stage last? Did they play on the stage? They played on the stage last. Did they? they did. I, I, I'm, assuming, I'm assuming it was like a... Mentality boost. All right. He wants to win with Wolf. That's what I'm seeing. He wants to win with Wolf here. And he, he's like, okay, well, I can do this with Meta Knight. So maybe it's like, just like, okay, I got a game. Let's readjust. And try this again with the character I want to win with. Oh, gets the Nair off stage, and that'll be it. There you go. Yep. Yeah. That was a great, great soft Nair. Oh, no, he's dead. And he's back. Oh. And oh. yet again, oh, like use of that reflector there. Yeah. Oh, is he starting to use Shine a lot more? Interesting. I mean, it's kind of hard for for Belmont to like break in like once Wolf kind of like gets in you know so there's only option at that point is just to up B and hope that he gets out of the situation relatively unscathed. Indeed. Indeed. Oh, grab, down throw. Yeah, it looks like K9 was waiting for a, uh, a tech option there but he didn't quite get anything. Yeah, he gets the grab, goes for the up throw, looking for the up air, not going to be able to quite find it, gets the fair off stage. Yet again, oh, he, he directional air dodges that off stage and uh, dies for it. Oh, no. Oh, okay, that was a good dash attack on it. Oh, 
Oh, oh. Again, gets the dare. Not going to be able to connect it with anything else. Yeah, the dare was a pretty good mix-up. At least in that situation, I feel. Finds an air off stage. Oh. But he holds down on the D-pad so that he can hit K9 trying to catch his recovery. Yeah, did not want to deal with the, the ledge option there, but another dash attack is going to get punished with that head smash again. Quick combo and opting not to go super down deep. Yeah, waiting, waiting out as opposed to instantly. Uh oh. Oh, he's starting. Oh, okay. Down tilt. Down tilt one. Yeah, I'm I'm kind of afraid for Nitro here. He's definitely giving vibes that he wants to be in the center as fast as possible. All right. Throwing out those down tilts a little bit too quickly. But yet again, once he's in center like this, you no, know, K9 is just struggling to get back. True. Oh, F tilt. I don't think he has a jump. No, he doesn't. He's dead. Yep. I mean, not much you can do right there. The K9 with his hand on his head. Not very pleased. I'm not sure if if uh, counter picking is required, but I feel like it'd make it easier. There are more opportunities for him to to do more off of it. Right. You know, like, he, he has more freedom, but he wants to win with Wolf. So, so you have to respect that. Yep. We're going to game four. It's Nitro in the lead. I mean, yet again, it's going to be one of those situations where, like, can K9, wow. you know, take this game and bring it back to a game five, or will Nitro finally end it? Will the, will the vampires curse me over? Yeah. Well, I guess the werewolves in this case. Yeah. I mean, they're, they're, there's the wolf man in his game, so I guess that's what wolf is in this scenario. Are these dash attacks getting consistently punished, I feel. I mean, dash attack is probably like one of Belmont's like, worst moves. It's just it's super laggy. Okay. Jump away. Holy fire, I guess, to try to ease off some pressure. Ooh, oh. but just reads that, like, like neutral option and gets an up smash for it. Reads the dare as well. Yeah. Gets that dash attack. A weak hit, I am at, I believe, but still. Oh, <laughs> oh. That, that traded with something, because I feel like... Was up smash. Yeah. That traded with up smash. That happened oh, earlier. Gets the holy fire to up smash. And yep. Like I was saying earlier, the holy water uh, trap with the uh, platforms definitely just a good option. Prevents uh, people from like falling. Yeah, yeah, prevent people from falling through the platform to try to uh, get to Belmont. Oh boy, I, he rolled in, but right through that F smash. So no punish for right now. We got tilt. Well, he's throwing these light crosses so he has more time to pressure oh you know canine finally catching on to those dares and double and jumping to punish it accordingly as well yeah. it's the grab out of that dash attack and looking for the get up option no not going to be able to find it expecting a roll i imagine or maybe just trying to get out of the situation uh probably expecting a roll i think Ooh, I, I like what richter did right there you know trying to like roll past Wolf to get the forward tail in order to send Wolf off stage. Dash forward, grab. Trying to mix up his landing. And here we go again with all the cross. And then the forward tail in there, it's the back air. Here comes the axe. And the axe oh. finally finds his mark, not quite enough to finish it. And it caught the jump, but yeah. Wolf's a little heavier. That fall like, speed's gonna help him too. Yeah, catches the jump there, and it, he air dodges, but still does not die for it. You know, immediately Ooh. up these afterwards. Grab out of F tilt. I mean, <laughs> Sakurai said it, that F tilt slow. Yeah. <laughs> it's it's balance. Yeah. You see, I made it like the video game. Oh, okay. I mean, it catching that air dodge into an F tilt too. Yeah. Oh, oh my god, he read that uh, air dodge in, but unfortunately, you know, 
Belmont's just going to stop right before it, but he gets that up smash, and we are going to last stock here. Uh, K9 again, down a game. Nitro at set winner. Oh, no, but uh, he, he didn't get punished for that. No, it didn't, didn't quite land it. Oh, the short hop aerial didn't approach with it, so it whiffed. Now he has to deal with the wall of nonsense. The wall of pain. The wall of pain. The wall of everything in the kitchen sink. Oh, uh, up smash, okay. I guess he expected K9 to still be on top of the platform, but he SDI down real fast. Yet again, gets the grab, throws him off stage. You know, Nitro has not been hit this stock at all. Is K9 gonna have an answer for it? But he doesn't! He's living, he's living. Oh, he's, he's living. Fine. Barely, but, but like he doesn't have a jump anymore. All right, he's, he's, he is on the ledge. Yeah, but and he's off the ledge, and, and he is dead. Dang. And with that, Nitro takes it. 3-1 in, in uh, Grand Finals 2. Yeah, K9 shaking his head. He had it, I yeah. feel. It's just that that last stop, he oh let him God. get, he let him get.